welcome everybody to the ZB Ho Dojo. My name is Spicer and I've been sculpting characters for video games, movies, TV, and collectibles for about 10 years now. And most of my focus has been in anatomy. So in this video, we're gonna be talking about how to sculpt the upper leg. But before we get into that, I wanna thank our sponsor, XMDacademy.com. From character creation to 3D printing to game development, XMD Academy will take you to that next level in your career. Check out my course, Character Creation for Collectibles, and use code SPICERMANYT to get 25% off my live workshop. You can also use code SUMMER15 to get 15% off anything at the XMDacademy.com website. Big thanks and shout out to xmdacademy.com for supporting the channel. I really, really appreciate that. And I hope you all get a chance to check out their uh, courses and their on-demand courses, and especially the XMD Toolbox. They are absolutely fabulous. So go check them out. Tell them Spicer Man sent you, all right? So in this new video series, um, I asked the community what they wanted a lecture on. Um, they wanted uh, male anatomy. So we took that and I was like, all right, well, what part of the male anatomy do y'all want to go over? And um, the overall consensus was leg anatomy. So in this um, three minutes and three tips, uh, I'm going to give you some pointers on uh, what to look for when you're sculpting legs or even sculpting in general. And um, if you want a more in-depth analysis of the upper leg, I have a art station tutorial that is live today. It's uh, $5, but if you use a coupon code SPICERMANYT, it's only $3. You see what I did? Three tips, three minutes, $3, okay? So that, um, that tutorial comes with a 30 minute lecture. It comes with uh, medical drawovers I do in real time, real life example drawovers I do in real time. And then I give you a ZBrush uh, sculpting lecture and then also uh, a sculpting time lapse that's probably about 10 times as long as what you're seeing in this video. So again, if you wanna check that out, go over to Shotgun Scream at Arts station.com and uh, check out my store I'll have a tutorial there and if this goes well and y'all really enjoy these videos I have no problem making more and educating the community on anatomy so that you can get a gig you can get a job and you can get paid all right so let's get into the time lapse thanks for being here everybody Alrighty, so I would say the first tip that you need to start off with in terms of getting the uh, the leg right, if you can't see it already, is use a skeleton. There's uh, plenty of uh, sites you can get a free skeleton. This particular one that I use uh, is from Bad King. I'll put the link in the description down below. Make sure to give him a little tip as well. He's made that site free for so long and rarely gets any praise for it. So just drop them like two, three bucks, buy him a hamburger, you know, or buy him some coffee. But, um, but yeah, I use that skeleton all the time. It's going to allow me to, um, uh, always set my proportions. But the thing that you really need to study if you're going to use it a lot is you need to understand the articulation of the skeleton as it moves. There's plenty of YouTube videos with x-rays and movements and all that, that you can use. So uh, definitely check that out. Second tip, learn the origination and insertion of just one of the sculptural muscles on this leg. Do that and see how much confidence you have the next time you sculpt this thing. If you want to know all about the upper leg and where these muscles originate from and insert into, I have a lecture on ArtStation that's about 30 minutes long. Um, I draw over medical drawings, I draw over real life examples, and then uh, another hour uh, of uh, ZBrush, how to apply it in ZBrush and showing you how I sculpt it in ZBrush. If you're interested in that, you can check out uh, the link below, go to ArtStation, Use the coupon code SPICERMANYT to get $2 off, making it just $3 for an hour and a half of sculptural gold knowledge. Third tip, know your bony landmarks. These are vital to a believable sculpt. 
these are the hard surface elements that are going to contrast all these fleshy muscles everywhere on on their uh, character right such as your elbow your knee uh, your clavicle your sternum your um, scapula the seventh vertebra I mean we can go on and on and on but if you don't know what those are and you don't know them uh, by their medical term then you're not gonna have a common language with all the other journeymen that are in this craft um, that that's the type of scientific um, mind that you need to have what is this where is it coming from where is it going to where are the hard surface elements of this character that is going to bring life to everything if you know that you automatically separate yourself from everyone else that's sculpting off of reference and shadows and you're sculpting off of solid anatomy knowledge Alrighty, everybody, I hope those tips helped you. Um, I know they're kind of general, um, but I think it really, really is going to help you uh, bring some more life to your character. Again, if you want a, a little bit deeper explanation about this, along with a longer time lapse and a 30 minute sculpting uh, lecture and uh, leg anatomy lecture, that's all on ArtStation at my profile, Shotgun Scream. So uh, definitely go check that out. I have a link down below. Make sure to use Use the uh, coupon code SpicermanYT to get $2 off, making it $3. And again, if you want to go even further, if you really, really, really want to become a champion real quick, go to XMDAcademy.com. Um, I'm... I have my uh, live workshop open for registration. I do not like to have a lot of people in there. I like to keep it nice and small. That way I give um, the proper amount of attention to each student, make sure we're addressing your concern. So uh, definitely go there and register before all the spots uh, fill up. I think we have like five or six so far. There's only about nine, maybe, maybe nine to like 12 more that I'll do. Because again, I do not like having a huge, huge class. So make sure to go there. Uh, make sure to like and subscribe and uh, make sure to go to the community and vote on the next tutorial that will be on this channel and available on ArtStation as well. I love teaching anatomy. I, I love seeing people take that next step and become more confident and have a whole lot more fun sculpting. And uh, I find the best way to do that is through workshops and tutorials. So make sure you do that. If you're interested in joining the ZB Ho Discord, that link is down below as well. And as always, thank you very much for joining us at the ZB Ho Dojo. My name is Spicer, and we will see you next time.